What's going on, everyone? I'm Jimmy Skaros, Masari's VP of Product, and today I'm thrilled to share what our team has been tirelessly working on over the past few months. Introducing Masari Copilot, your AI assistant for crypto. Copilot delivers crypto intelligence on demand, all cited with Masari's trusted research and up-to-date data sets. Copilot represents a significant leap forward in the evolution of the Masari product. It was specifically designed to streamline some of the most critical workflows in crypto. Today, I'll highlight a few ways Copilot was designed to make your life easier. Let's start with news and current events. For anyone working in crypto, keeping up with major news events is one of the most time-consuming tasks we face daily. Recently, MakerDAO was in the news as they underwent a, a massive project update with their formal rebrand to Sky. Let's ask Copilot to summarize what I need to know about those changes and see if we can understand the token conversions that took place. All right, so let's dive into the demo here. Uh, I'm going to expand Copilot, go to the, our full screen view, and I'm going to start with a question about the Maker, MakerDAO rebrand. I'm going to say, summarize the details of MakerDAO to Sky rebranding event and what what, and how does this fill into Maker's endgame strategy that we've heard so much about? All right, so Copilot's back with an answer here. And you can see that the first section is going to be about the Maker DAO to, to, to Sky rebranding event. And then as you scroll down, the second section of the answer here is about how it fits into Maker's endgame strategy. And one of the first things you're going to notice is all these little blue numbers at the end of, a, of our sentences here. These are citations, and this is a big differentiator for Copilot. We are source grounded. So Copilot will not give you insights unless it can back them up with source materials, allowing you to go deeper down the rabbit hole if you, sh if you should choose. You can hover over any of these citations or scoot down to the bottom and see the source section. And you can see, in order for us to bring that answer to you, we checked on asset profiles that we had for Sky Protocol. We, we checked our Intel events that we had for the, the governance token. Uh, and then we also used our uh, news events that we had for uh, a, a couple different news articles here. Uh, we also pulled some information from our diligence report on Maker. And we even have a video talking about um, the rebranding event, too. So you can watch this video or, or go through the summary. Uh, the other thing you'll notice at the bottom, too, is the two related questions. These questions are personalized for your questions and answer. Uh, Copilot will bring back two additional questions that they think you can, that we think you can go down the, the rabbit hole deeper if you should, choo if you should choose. You can just click on these, and, uh, and Copilot will, will have a follow-up question with those. Now, Misari Copilot is the most efficient way to quickly synthesize events and summarize news in crypto, even those from just 15 minutes ago. Let's use Copilot to understand what I missed at the recent Solana conference. All right, so Solana Breakpoint was about two weeks back. I wasn't in attendance, but I can ask Copilot about any of these industry events. Um, so I'm going to just ask it, recap the Solana Breakpoint 2024 event, and highlight any notable talks. And just like that, Copilot has the recap for me. Uh, it goes through and gives me an overview of the event. It, it calls out key highlights and innovations, talks about some notable talks and announcements, uh, and even some future outlooks. Again, it cites a number of different external news articles that you can read deeper if you should choose or read the summaries if you want. Or we can actually watch some of the conference videos directly from the answer here. So you're able to just play these session videos or read our summaries um, to save some time. So, Super helpful, and just a reminder that our data in Copilot is fresh as of 15 minutes ago, uh, which is awesome to cover breaking, breaking events. Now that we've seen how Copilot can help keep you up to date, let's dive into research. Misari is known for its best in class research. Our new Copilot allows you to effortlessly cast an industry wide net and deeply research any crypto topic with ease. <clears throat> Copilot is the ideal starting point for your research and the perfect tool to dive deeper. Let's give it a try. So recently, uh, I heard about a new restaking protocol called Symbiotic 
Um, and I want to ask Copilot to tell me a little bit more about this. I'm only familiar with Eigenlayer, a different uh, restaking protocol. So you can ask Copilot these comparison questions, and it can be uh, really useful for, the, uh, for you to provide some insights. So just like that, I asked, tell me about Symbiotic, and how does this project compare to Eigenlayer? Copilot's returned with a nice breakdown of Symbiotic, it talks about the key features of Symbiotic, a little bit about the token, and then it goes into the overview of Eigenlayer. And then it has a really rich section about the comparison between the two, so from similarities and, and differences, as well as providing some recent developments about the two. You can see that it's all fully sourced, and we're pulling from our rich asset profiles, as well as our diligence reports, as well as some uh, wider industry news articles for some of those recent developments. This is uh, really interesting, a lot of information here, but obviously I can't read, read it on the fly right now because I'm doing a demo. But let me ask Copilot a follow-up question. So Copilot supports follow-up questions for as many as you have. And the cool thing about follow-up questions is it retains the context of your question and answer, so you don't have to repeat things. Uh, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ask Copilot a follow-up question here. Can you summarize the difference in a table? So Copilot's going to think about it for a second. It's going to use the context from above. It's going to check all of our qualitative and quantitative structured data sources. And it's going to come back with our, our, first, uh, our first sighting of a dynamic table. And this is another cool feature of Copilot. So this table here, which I can stretch out, is not found anywhere in our product. This was created on the fly for your answer. And Copilot came back with a three-column table one related to features, one related to symbiotic, and one related to eigenlayer, breaking things down very easily for me at a glance. Uh, I can go deeper here with the sources just like anywhere else. Uh, and just at a glance, it looks like symbiotic supports more collateral options uh, than eigenlayer, which is uh, beyond Ethereum, which is really cool. So I can, I can go deeper down the research rabbit hole if I wanted to right here. Uh, but uh, Copilot was super useful in getting to that information. Next, how many of you have ever read a Masari research piece and came across a useful visual or a chart only later to forget where you found it again? Copilot can help not only find, but also understand these research visuals. Let's try to find the latest Masari deep in sector map with Copilot. So uh, I'm going to start with a question for, for Copilot. And if you've ever read Masari research, you know that it's filled with really rich graphics, tables, diagrams sector maps like we're talking about here. Uh, and Copilot can help retrieve those for you. Um, so I'm going to ask a question. Tell me about the latest DPIN developments. And please be sure to include the latest DPIN sector map. Just like that, it has a summary of the recent developments. And if I scroll down, in the source section, it grabbed the latest sector map for me. Um, so this is awesome. I didn't have to go digging for this. I didn't have to look through past research. Uh, it provides it as a source, and, but what you could see here is it actually uses it as a citation. So the really cool thing about this answer is that uh, this section here actually describes what's in the sector map. It breaks down the image and understands the insights from it. And this is the really powerful thing about Copilot is it doesn't just retrieve images or inject them into your answers. It helps you understand them, and it can help dissect the images to go deeper. So super useful and uh, a really a game changer for, um, for understanding Masari research. You can see that it, it pulled from our research articles, some, some new or research reports, some news articles, our fundraising data rounds for uh, some of the recent development activity above. And then it actually pulled from our new feature, which launched last week, our topics feature which bundles a number of different like-kind uh, news articles under one cohesive topic. So I highly recommend you guys check out the topic uh, feature as well that went live uh, under, under news. Um, so super useful in understanding visuals and, and going deeper on research. Now, sometimes research in crypto calls for time-consuming data aggregations from multiple sources. Copilot has access to all of Misari's structured data making these aggregations an ask away. Um, so let's say you've been tasked with trying to find a couple of different, uh, a couple of different metrics about some popular networks. Um, maybe you're looking for the average transactions per second and total fee revenue, ju but just from last month. And you only want it for Ethereum, Base, Solana, and Bitcoin. Normally, you'd have to jump through a number of different tools or different products. 
to get this information, download it, and potentially manipulate it in another tool. Not anymore. Copilot lets you just ask the question. And what it's going to do here is it's going to sense that we're talking about four different networks, and it's going to realize that it has to go and do a data aggregation. It has access to our structured network metrics. It's going to go to our network metrics and pull these calculations for you and return them. So here's the answer. You can see it has two figures for each network, uh, all fully cited, pointing to our network data set, and saving me a lot of time, <clears throat> which is super useful. So that's research. How about fundraising? Misari's fundraising data set is the best in the industry. Copilot now makes it super easy to surface signal and investment narratives in crypto. Let's see if we could find exciting new projects by seeing where notable investors have co-invested. So uh, if you're like me, you like to pay attention to where VCs in the space put their money. Well, with Copilot, you can find out like-kind projects that took investments from notable investors. We're going to ask a question like, what companies have both Coinbase Ventures and Paradigm on their cap table, and then do a sort based on recency of investments? Copilot is able to understand that this is a, uh, a question that's going to require our fundraising data set. It's going to go and look in our structured data and come back uh, with an aggregated answer for us here. And just like that, we have another dynamic table sorted by recency of investment uh, with a couple projects that we probably should be paying attention to. Um, so from here, you can start with another follow-up question, go a little deeper about these projects. But it just shows you that Copilot has full access to the structured data of, of our fundraising product. How about someone doing business development in the crypto industry looking for prospects? Copilot can be a great time saver when doing lead gen. So let's say you've been tasked with potentially uh, inbounding to a couple of uh, projects in the space. Maybe you have a product that you could sell to, the gaming, to gaming companies in the space. You can use Copilot to generate these lead lists. We can ask a question like, please tell me all the gaming questions that raised more than $5 million, but only in 2024. And then please list the funded entity name, round, amount raised, and date. And just like that, Copilot, again, is going to realize that it needs to reach into our funding data set. And it has a couple of pieces of criteria that it needs to care about. It's only going to pull back, pro, uh, it's only going to pull back investments greater than $5 million. And then it needs to time limit it to 2024. And you can see in the response, that's exactly what it did. Uh, it's pulling the, the, uh, the projects that have raised more than $5 million in 2024. And it gave us another dynamic list that I can use for prospecting. Now, this is great. Maybe this is something that I want to share with my team. You can use Copilot's built-in share functionality to do that. You go up here, you click the Share button, and you create a custom link. And you can now send this to your team or coworkers and potentially tag team this uh, to inbound to these prospects, which saves a ton of time. So clearly, it's really useful for fundraising. What about when there's no room for wrong answers or hallucinations, like when doing due diligence? Misari is a market leader in the crypto compliance space, helping professionals perform in-depth reviews of assets with our diligence product. Copilot supercharges any due diligence process by freeing our asset diligence data to be used not in ways not possible today. So uh, we constantly get feedback that people love our diligence reports, but all the time I'm asked, do you have a report that maybe uh, shows multiple assets or cross assets? I really like that, uh, the information that's in, uh, that's in a, a diligence report, but I want to understand how it benchmarks against other assets. Well, Copilot can break down these barriers for you. You can ask questions like compare and contrast the native asset functions of BitTensor versus Render to AI projects in the space, and Copilot can get you this answer on the fly. You can see that it came back with a full breakdown of, of how the Tau assets used for BitTensor and what the functions are, the tokenomics of that project. And then the same thing with Render. It also gave us a key differences section. Uh, everything's fully cited with high quality sources using Masari data. And you can see it even retrieved an image from earlier this year where there was a research report talking about how BitTensor overtook Render uh, to be the sector leader in the AI narrative. 
down below, you can see that it drew from our asset profiles, our Intel events, our research reports, a couple different industry news articles, and of course, pulling from multiple sources from our diligence reports to answer this question with the best trusted data. Now, ongoing and real-time monitoring of assets is a critical activity that many of our infrastructure customers do daily. Copilot can be a critical tool to ensure that you have all the information you need about important and time-sensitive changes to assets under your watch. Sometimes, however, the most important decisions come in informal settings, like on developer calls. Copilot is always tuned in, so you don't have to be. Um, OK, so if you, if you follow Ethereum, you know that a, a lot of important decisions happen. On, uh, there are two developer calls that, that happen fairly regularly. You, we could ask questions like outline what was covered in Ethereum's most recent consensus and execution developer meetings. So go and find the latest in both of those meetings and let me know what happened in them. Copilot uh, recognizes that it, it needs to use firsthand sources for this, so it's going to draw upon uh, the transcripts and summaries of these, of these videos themselves. And you can see that it came back with a bulleted breakdown of what happened in the consensus meeting from September 19th and the execution meeting from September 12th. It also gave us some color from others uh, on, on you know, what their takes are for, for the latest calls. You can also even watch these full developer calls directly in here, too. So this is just representative of Copilot is tuned in to the industry podcasts and videos. Uh, so it saves you a lot of time. So with Copilot, you can take back time and eliminate hours of firsthand listening while still monitoring important videos or industry podcasts. These examples only scratch the surface of the power of Copilot. Be sure to stay tuned for many more significant Copilot abilities in the near future. Now, over to Duran Lee, Misari's CTO. Thank you. Thank you for that fantastic demo, Jimmy. Now, let me tell you why Masari Copilot is not just another AI assistant. It's a game changer for crypto professionals like you. First, Copilot is trustworthy and transparent. It retrieves information from our curated data, all quality controlled by our expert team. And with citations for every output, you can trust but verify the information that you receive. Second, it offers in-depth data coverage. Copilot taps into Masari's expensive data warehouse, 30 terabytes of structured and unstructured data, giving you a 360-degree view of the crypto landscape, from exclusive research and market intelligence to on-chain metrics and fundraising data. And finally, Copilot is built for crypto professionals. We designed it with power users in mind. Our advanced AI tool integration means you get rapid, accurate insights, giving you the speed and efficiency you need to stay ahead in this fast-paced industry. Thank you, and we can't wait to see what you'll accomplish with Masari Copilot. Thank you.